Greetings. I'm Michael Quinn Patton. We hear a lot about threats to democracy these days, so it might be a good time to reflect on the role of evaluation in supporting democracy. For that, I want to turn to the wisdom of the most politically astute person I've encountered in my 60-year evaluation career, Eleanor Chalimsky. Eleanor Chalimsky was a founder of the Evaluation Research Society in the 1970s, the predecessor organization of the American Evaluation Association, and she was a president of the American Evaluation Association. She founded and directed the Government Accountability's Office, Program Evaluation and Methodology Division, which between 1980 and 1994 was charged with doing evaluations for Congress and improving GAO's methodological capabilities. With 80 to 100 people, her unit had between 45 and 50 evaluations underway at any given time and produced 30 major evaluations annually. Cumulatively, she directed more than 300 major public policy evaluations. She once said, telling the truth to the people who may not want to hear it at all is, after all, the chief purpose of evaluation. An interview as a part of the Eleanor Chalimsky Theory to Practice Forum, she reflected on the relationship between evaluation and politics and said, quote, Indeed, if you ask me what was the most important thing we've achieved during the 45 years or so that evaluation and politics have been partners, I'd say you need to look beyond the individual effects we've had on specific policies or programs over time, even though many of these have been substantive and consequential. Instead, she said, in my judgment, the major accomplishment evaluation has been the establishment and demonstration of a trustworthy, dependable tool in government for carrying out and preserving political accountability. She went on, so we have to get it right, because if we don't try and don't succeed, and systematic evaluation of what the government is doing becomes a thing of the past, then our failure would affect not only evaluation itself, but also our democracy and its political freedoms. She went on to say, quote, when you come right down to it, we're like canaries in the mine shaft. Our presence means that public accountability is alive and well. But if we go, the nation will have lost a lot more than evaluation. 